very warm welcome. Alex Alban Durabon is a Grand Prix winner again as he wins his first race in DTM. A dominant drive at the Nürburgring where in F1 he actually had a terrible race. He's dominated and he's won for the first time in DTM. Probably his first win in years. His last win would have been in Formula 2. Um, yeah, this is... Um, one of them feel-good factor stories. Obviously, heartbreak for Alexander Albon as he got dropped, promoted, then dropped, then lost his seat completely, doing DTM. Liam Lawson's been getting a lot of headlines. Albon wins his first race. Now, I didn't watch the race, but my phone's going absolutely crazy. Of course, every time we talk about Albon, it gets mixed views. People say he's not good enough. But I've got to say, this is a quite a good story, as he is, he's won his first race in DTM. All he can really do, I mean, he's spending a lot of time in the simulator. Red Bull was leading both championships in Formula 1. And he's been doing a pretty solid job in DTM. He lies fourth in the driver's standings now. Who knows, can he win the championship? But yeah, he's won. In DTM, a dominant drive at the Nürburgring. Um, yeah, I could have watched the race, but I've been there's quite a lot on today, so I've been watching the build up to the United game, been watching a bit of Le Mans. But yeah, Alexander Albon has won a DTM race. I'm happy for him. Obviously, Albon's a nice guy, but yeah, he's won a race in DTM. Looked very happy on the podium as his. Thai national anthem played yeah I mean as soon as he won the race my phone started going berserk so I was like what is going on here Alexander Albon has won his first race in DTM really happy for him um, yeah can he get back on the F1 grid that's his aim obviously he's doing his simulator work he's now won a race in DTM he lies fourth in the championship can he win the championship and there may be a possibility he could get back on the F1 grid and take Yuki Tsunoda's place. As Yuki, very, he's got the speed, but very erratic, lots of crashes. But Albon, great in Toro Rosso, Alfa Tori, got the promotion. Just no confidence, regularly pummeled by Max. Got a podium eventually, but it was too little too late. Now he's always in the simulator, spending like 20 days a month in the simulator. And he's got his DTM duties. But Alexander Albon has won a race in DTM. A dominant drive at the Nürburgring. Um, yeah, I'm happy for him. Let's see what the future holds for Alexander Albon, number 23.